topic, especially if you're gonna sell your house, friend. Today, I'm talking about hidden problems. Things are going wrong along very smoothly, but you don't know there's a problem going on. Nobody's telling you anything because nobody really knows. One person always knows if there's a hidden problem going on with the file. If you're buying a house, if you're selling a house, there's two parties involved, the buyer and the seller. The deal can only happen if the buyer has the ability to pay cash or get a loan to do the, to do, to consummate the deal, I think is how we would say this. So uh, most closings take place, they're, they're about 30 to 45 days after the contract has been written, accepted, we're moving forward. Well, people get pre-qualified and say, if me and Kathleen were going through the pre-qualifying procedure, she's going to give me information and I am just going to accept it as certain. It's 100% certain. There's nothing wrong with anything. Well, as uh, the file is getting closer to closing, everything is kind of gathered proving what she was saying to me as her loan officer. She, everything is proven. Then at the very, very end is when everything breaks down. That's when it goes in front of the internal auditor. The underwriters, they're gonna verify all this stuff and these things can take days. Well, here's some things that you don't know. When things are taking longer than expected, Appraisals are taking longer. Getting information back is taking longer. Are they stalling? Are they just trying to buy more time to figure problems out? Unfortunately, in our business, in the, in the home buying and selling process, the problems come up at the very end. It's kind of like an airplane. Taking off or landing is whenever you see most of the problems. So you could just be sailing right along at 38,000 feet, not knowing there's a sneaky little problem that's developing. They could just crash the bird, crash the plane. You don't know this until the very end. That's why you need a navigator like Lisa Progar that is systematically checking on, hey, last week we were waiting on this and this is all we needed to move forward to be able to close. So the next week we don't just call and ask simple questions like, hey, how's it going? Chum, chum, and we don't do that. We wanna know exactly where you are on that roadmap to closing. And we're gonna say last week you told us you were here. Now we're calling this week, did you get this taken care of? Now what are we waiting on? Is there anything else that's gonna hold up or cause this plane to come down from out of the sky, Stevie Z? So be on the lookout for this. It's about a 30 to 45 day window. You write the contract, but during all this time, that buyer, that borrower, they've gotta prove all this stuff to the lender. Then the lender, the underwriter, you know, they're the sheriff of this whole file. They're gonna look at it and they're gonna be okay with it or they're not gonna be okay with it. So our problems don't happen until the very end. Keep that in mind. So a lot of times it's smooth sailing in your mind, but really there's something going on you're not even aware of. That's why you gotta have somebody that is always in that file checking on things.